Well, some Missouri environmental regulations have been waived, allowing cleanup crews to throw away debris left behind from the floods without being charged. WGEM's Quentin Parker has the story. The Missouri Department of Natural Resources normally bans trash collection companies from dumping yard waste, tree limbs, brush, stumps, and draft wood in its landfills. We can pick them up, and we do pick them up, but they have to go to separate places. Uh, they, can't, they just can't be buried in a, in a sanitary landfill. But the flood of 08 changed all of that. The Missouri DNR has lifted that ban for 60 days. Collection companies like Allied Waste Services can pick up and drop off debris from the flood at no extra charge though one expert says it could take even longer. I would think that the state will probably go ahead and extend that out. I think they just did an initial one uh, for a 60-day period just to see, see what we can get, but I think with the cleanup going slower and the water's taking longer to recede than they thought, I think you'll probably see a 30 or 60-day uh, extension of that. The ban was lifted with the hope of helping homeowners and businesses get rid of debris in one place rather than having to find different places for different items. Flood debris can now be put on the curbs. Allied Waste collects about 450 tons of trash in a day. They've averaged another 100 tons since flood cleanup has started. Other debris like appliances and large items are also being collected free of charge, but those items are being recycled. Reporting from LaGrange, I'm Quentin Parker, WGEM News.